Hello and welcome to the Slow Computer Using Educators Annual Affiliate Report. I'm Eric Jarvis, Slow Q's Treasurer, and I'm presenting the slides that were created by John Miller, our Vice President. Slow Q has had an extremely active and successful year, and we have many innovative and exciting events planned for the upcoming year. You'll notice we have a brand new logo. It's featured at the center of this page. A Slow Q serves the entire San Luis Obispo County, which is located about halfway between LA and San Francisco and just east of the Central Valley. As you can tell from the photos, it's a gorgeous county with the beautiful vineyards in Paso Robles, the city of Slow, which was voted the nation's happiest city, Morro Bay, and the beaches of Cayucas, Cambria, Pismo Beach, Avila Beach, so beaches, vineyards, beautiful mountains, fun cities, college town. It's a great place. And we've, as we've been holding events, we're finding people are really excited to come to San Luis Obispo County. Our executive board consists of Pat Renshaw, president. She's a media specialist with the San Luis Obispo County Office of Education. John Miller, our vice president, and he's a sixth grade teacher with the King City Unified School District a Google certified teacher, a rock star teacher, a regular presenter at Q, and he holds many more credentials. Pam Hernandez is our secretary. She's an administrator with the San Luis Obispo County Office of Education, serving our, their uh, special education population. I'm Eric Jarvis, and I'm the treasurer. I'm a sixth grade teacher with the uh, Los Osos Middle School in the brand new one-to-one -one device STEAM program there. I'm also a Google certified teacher as well and a regular presenter at uh, workshops and Q events. Marsha Lifter is our member at large. She's an instructor at Cal Poly, teaches their ed tech class. She also supervises student teachers for Cal Poly, and she's the author of a series of books entitled for ter terrified teachers. As I said, we've been extremely uh, uh, active in 2012. We've held multiple coffee queues and a few brew queues as well. We held a meetup at ISTE in San Diego. Our social dinner at the Q Conference in Palm Springs was very well attended, a big, huge hit, and a lot of fun. We held our first contested elections in several years, which shows that people are excited about slow queue and they want to get involved in, the leader in our leadership. We had a very successful Slow Q Connects Ed Tech event at New Tech High in Nopomo. More on that later. We held a Fall Q meetup and several other activities. Our Slow Q Connects was a huge hit. We had an uh, outstanding uh, keynote speaker from iFixit. We had sponsors. It was sponsored by Troxel. They bought lunch for all of the over 100 attendees. Thank you, Troxel. Troxel. The Gaming Network was there, Lightspeed, and My Big Campus was there, and it was co-sponsored by the Lucia Mar Unified School District. It was such a huge success. Lucia Mar is very excited to present this event again, and it will be held. It was held on October 6, 2012, and they want to run it again with us. So they're very excited about doing that. And it's going to be held October 5th, 2013. Okay, Q staff and Q board members, get on down to the beautiful San Luis Obispo County, October 5th, 2013, for a great conference in a beautiful location. The 2012 conference featured a variety of speakers and presentations, including local speakers, James McMillan uh, using the iPad from San Luis Coastal, Jennifer O'Hagan also from the San Luis Coastal Unified School District, Henry Danielson, the Director of Technology for Coast Union, and we held, uh, and John, our own John Miller and Eric Jarvis presented as well. We also had some Q regular presenters, including Chris Scott and Will Kimberly. Um, Outstanding presentation. We had four all-day presentation. Huge, huge success. So here, as you can see, some of the list of some of the other uh, well-known, extremely talented presenters we featured. Our plans for 2013, we're going to continue with our Coffee Queue events. We're working on, on kind of an end-of-the-year social brew queue or, and or Coffee Queue event. Uh, we also, in 2013, we promoted a Q Rockstar. It was held in Paso Robles. We promoted the Maker Fair. Uh, we'll have another social dinner at Q. We'll organize that. More elections to come. Um, we promoted Central Coast STEM event through a joint project between Cal Poly and Cuesta. Our Slow Q Connects, as we mentioned, was October 5th. And Slow Q has worked with a number of districts on their BITSA workshops and helping them present uh, tech ed tech conferences for those as well. 
The rock star camp that was hosted in our county was a, another another huge success. So we had great speakers. That was very well attended. It was held at the uh, Australia Warbird Museum. Great location. Very interesting. That was in East Paso Robles. I personally lived here for a long time, never knew the place existed, and I was extremely impressed. So John Carippo was there, John Miller, Chris Scott, Will Kimberly, Alice Keeler. It was kind of a smaller scale once. It was a uh, you know evening and into the half a day the following day. Well attended. People were very excited about it. I heard nothing but good things about the rock star camp that was held here in Paso Robles. So John Miller, our own vice president, was the organizer of that. He did an outstanding job. We've been having frequent communications with members and just interested ed tech people. Very active Twitter account. We're all over Twitter, tweeting and uh, promoting our events, promoting other uh, organizations' events that relate to education and more specifically ed tech. We launched our Facebook page and people have been comment commenting on that. Uh, we're, we have our own blog within our website and our website is still very active. It's SLO. CUE.org, slowq.org. We plan on revamping that this year, although it, I personally think it looks great. We're still going to make it look even better. And we also have our, um, our email list, which consists of hundreds of members, uh, uh, hundreds of uh, interested people and our members. Our current budget is $1,630, and we have a proposed spending of $1,575 in our uh, 2012 2013 budget and our 2013 14 budget have been submitted to Q. So, this has been a presentation by the San Luis Obispo Computer Using Educators or Slow Q. We're very active. We would love to have um, board members come down and see us, come to some of our events. Like I think I said before, it's a beautiful place with lots to do. Um, if you like golf or wine tasting, great restaurants, just the great ambiance of a great college town, the beaches, the cliffs, fishing, tennis. We have be beautiful beaches, a lot of fun people, a lot of innovative teachers. Come on down, especially come on down for our Slow Q Connects conference, with, which is October 5th, 2013 at New Tech High School in Nopomo, California. We hope to see you there, and thanks for listening to our presentation.